Hey YouTube, this is Haley from 101 Rabbits, and I'm doing a video today on rabbit's diet. Um, today I'm going to be talking especially about the adult's rabbit diet. If you want to see um, baby rabbit's diet, then you can check out my last upload. At least I think it was my last upload. And, um, yeah. So, the first thing I'm going to be talking about is hay. Hay is the most important thing in rabbit's diet, even if they're babies. They should be fed unlimited Timothy hay. And um, so there's, the, I'm going to tell you the different kinds of hay you can get. You can get Timothy, Western Timothy, Orchard Grass, Oat Hay, Monocle Hay, Meadow Hay, and Bluegrass. Um, there's other hays such as like Three Hay Blend and everything like that, but I've never really seen that sold anywhere. But, yeah, there's a lot of different hays you can have. So if your rabbit won't eat Timothy or it's not available in your area, then you can get different kinds of hay. Alfalfa hay is made for baby rabbits, though, and it will make adult rabbits fat. So don't use that if your rabbit is over one year or, like, seven months. So the second most important thing is veg veggies. And... Rabbits should have two cups of veggies for six pounds of body weight. The different vegetables you can give them are alfalfa, radish, and clover sprouts, baby bok choy, basil, beet greens, bok choy, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, carrot and carrot tops, celery, cilantro, clover, collard greens, dandelion greens, and flowers. But make sure you don't pick them out of your yard because there could be unknown pesticides that you don't know about or anything like that. Um, endive, escarole, green pepper, kale, mint, mustard greens, parsley, and pea, and pea pods. Um, peppermint leaves, radish tops, raspberry leaves, romaine lettuce, but not iceberg. Iceberg is not good for rabbits has no nutrients whatsoever and it's just like pure water there's no reason to give your um, rabbits that and since it has so much water in it it like soaks up a whole bunch of water then like any pesticides they used on it to kill any sort of bugs so gets soaked up into the iceberg lettuce and so when your rabbit eats it it's actually eating some chemicals too um, after I heard that it makes me not want to eat iceberg lettuce anymore. Um, but anyway, you can also feed them spinach and wheatgrass. Vegetables such as kale, um, broccoli, and um, some other ones. You don't want to feed more than two times a week because it can cause gas, which can be very dangerous. It, it causes gas bubbles in their GI tract, which causes nothing else to be able to go through, meaning they can't poop, so that is very dangerous for rabbits, and sometimes you have to take them into the vet. So for the next thing in your rabbit's diet is pellets. Pellets, you should give one-fourth to one-half one-fourth to a half cup of pellets to your rabbit for six pounds of body weight. Um, but this also depends on the metabolism and how much veggies you feed. So if their metabolism is really high, you might want to give them a little more pellets. But if they're really lazy and lay around all day, then you might want to give them a little less because it could cause them to get fat. Um, but if you feed a whole bunch of vegetables and different kinds, then you can lower your pellet amount because they're getting some nutrients from the vegetable, more nutrients from the vegetables. So yeah, I hope that makes sense. The next most, the next thing in your rabbit's diet is fruit. Fruit is not required, but like, it's a good thing to give them once in a while. Um, fruit you should give no more than two tablespoons for six pounds of body weight a day. So, pretty much, it's like two spoonfuls. You don't want to give them any more treats, um, fruit than that a day. Just because it has high sugar and it can make a rabbit fat. So, um, the different fruits you can give your rabbits 
our apple, but re remember to remove the stem and the seeds. Um, the seeds can be harmful if ate, if eaten too much, and I'm not sure about the stem, but it says not to feed it, so. Um, blueberries, melon, orange, but not the peels. Papaya, peach, pear, pineapple, plums, raspberries, and strawberries. Sugary fruits such as bananas and grapes should only be fed sparingly um, as an occasional treat because these um, bananas and grapes are really high in sugar and it can cause your rabbit to get fat and stuff like that. So the other, the other ones I listed are better for rabbits. So I think that covers everything. Um, as for the pellets, if you're not sure what brand to get, um, you could get Oxbow, the brand I use. It's a really good brand, and it's recommended by vets um, all over. You can also get American Pet Diner and Supreme's Nature's Promise. I've never personally tried American Pet Diner or Supreme's Nature's Promise, but I've heard they're very good pellets as well. There's also this one other kind of pellets I can't remember at the moment. Um, but if I remember sometime, maybe I'll make a video about it. So, yeah, that's pretty much um, what I have for you today. So, thanks for watching. If you have any more questions, you can comment below or private message me. Or you can contact me on my Facebook, which is Haley's Rabbits. And you can message me there or post on my wall. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Bye!